Yo, what's going on guys? Welcome back to the channel, and of course, welcome back to Mocking the Hearts. So before I moved on to the final area, the final world, I just wanted to quickly go back, um, because I remember the chest that I missed in here is actually going to be something of use and of what I need. So this chest up here, we want to beat all the Heartless and then get that chest. So hopefully this won't take too long to take all these guys out. Then we can grab that chest and then move on to the final world. Leveling up one more time as well, just to. I just think one more strength increase for Sora would probably mean. There we go, we've just leveled up, but we didn't get what I wanted. That's a shame. I was just thinking one more strength increase would um, probably be enough to kill these guys um, in one combo before they kind of disappear. So the large bodies in here though don't seem to be all that difficult to beat. That's if you can actually get behind them. So there's a spirit shard there. Right, so this is where we've got the invisible person again. Oh, I've fallen down. Not only have I fallen down, but we've lost Donald. Goofy just put himself back, that's handy. But I think we're gonna be in real struggle zones here. Yeah, so these invisible guys, I just I just don't know how to beat them. If anyone else knows, then please feel free to tell me. So I did just notice another chest, um, and it's really confused me as to what one. I'm sure it's the, the one I've just said about that I need to actually go to. Um, at least I hope it is. If not, we'll get them both anyway. Um, one was obviously something I was, you know, was meant to get in the last video so I did, I, when I mentioned it. Still yet to mention what's in it, but that will be... If any of you don't know, then that's the reason I'm adding it into this video. Um, so you can, you can find it on, on your own playthroughs. That helps. Love that tunnel. Right, while this wizardy thing is doing that fast attack, put the staff down, and then you can attack. So we come up, we're going to just do it floor by floor and hope it means, you know, that it's a bit easier. One more of these there. That's 
start with this one. So that one's the dark matter. So it is this one that we need. So we want to try and stay here and not go up to the next field. Because then we should be able to just do that. So there's the Dalmatians. And here is the final keyblade. Oh, I'm just giving it away. I meant to say chest, not final keyblade. But there you go. So we've got the Oblivion Keyblade. So I did kind of get it away a little bit there. So Oathkeeper and then we have obviously Oblivion. So my two favourite Keyblades. So Oathkeeper is bigger. You can see it's got more range, it's stronger but less MP. So it's, it's a tough one to choose. I'm going to go for it just because again it is awesome. Look at that. That little bit of extra um, strength will help us as we kind of go through as well anyway. Um, we're just going to bypass these. Hit this. Hold the dummy ship. And we are going to make our way over here. So what I'll do is I'll cut out all the gummy ship uh, as usual so you don't have to, to sit through that um, and save you guys some time. Okay, so here we are, end of the world. Let's crack on and see what, let's see what we've got going on. Is that all that's left of the worlds taken by the Heartless? Those worlds will be restored if we beat Ansem, right? You betcha! But if we do beat him, and all these worlds become restored and disconnected, what's going to happen to this place? And to us? Well, uh... ah, we crossed This is a Heartless to... world, so maybe it'll just disappear. Huh? But no worries. Even if this place goes poof, our hearts ain't going nowhere. I'm sure we'll find our pals again. Yep, I just know that we will. <laughs> yep. I'm glad Goofy's optimistic. Yeah, you're right. Got our lucky charm from I'll return Kyrie. this. I promise. Right, so obviously to get the chests, we're going to have to do some, some fights by the looks of it, that's pretty cool. I mean, these guys seem pretty solid. But with us all going together... Okay. Did anyone else notice my health being low there? Because I didn't. There was no indication of low health. Just kind of cool. Um, okay. Well, they keep just kind of digging themselves into the ground, but I'm not sure what that does. So I'm just going to stay away from the one so there's the chest that we were kind of coming over for. So again, I'm keeping an eye on my health. My health seems to be pretty solid. There's one down. They've gone back on the ground. He's come back out. But it seems to be that when they put their swords in the ground, that someone else kind of takes their 
their play. Like, another one comes back. Again, no indication whatsoever that I was low on health. No noises. So they're obviously hitting for a huge amount of... A huge amount of... Um, damage on each hit. Um, let's see. I've got spare AD, so I can equip that over that. Kitted as we can be, really. It's just obviously a, Heal. a tough fight. Um, so maybe we just we just try again, I guess. Started as three, didn't it? I think anyway. I think it started that there was three of them. And now there's now there's I don't know how many of them. Well, I've just worked out I think how I'm being killed. He just used an attack that covered me in orbs. And then they just kind of all closed in on me. So I wonder if that has something to do with it. I wonder if that's what I've not been paying attention to. And it's actually quite a big attack for, for power, maybe. But there we go. There's the first bit done. We get the chest. shard and we move on to the next one Pretty stone for that one. The next one's here. So it's definitely worth getting all of these. Because you do get some you do get some good bits. I mean I thought I just picked up a high potion, but maybe it was the mega potion. for this one and so this is the boss that we just had a fight against in to seal the keyhole in Hollow Bastion so we know how to beat this guy Myself ready before going back in. Now we go again. Come 
So it's nice to be joined up here this time. See if we can put in more work, more damage. And quicker as well. Oh, you joking, he was a one shot there. That'll do it. Got a nice bit of kit for us there as well. So, mithril from that one. So, we've got one, two, three, four, five, six left. By my count. Two over there, three there, one in front of us here. in these ones before these like so they've got block obviously he's charging up so big I'm not sure how many of them there are I think there's three left so I think two left now. He's blocking. So I think these are the first ones we've come up against that can, can full on block your attacks like this. But there it is. It's another win. Where's the box we were trying to get? It's there. Elixir that time. This should help. Before we go in, I'm going to heal up. Mithril shard. Just trying to look to see what to do. I think I'm going to do these two, then that far one, far green one, and then the green one over there, maybe. <laughs> Right, so this could be a difficult one with these guys that block. They send that big attack out as well. And then also these guys with their all the attack thing. What he's gonna try and use now. In terms of actual damage that they take, they don't take a lot to kill. It's more that they are powerful when they hit you. So for example there, that Ragnarok pretty much just took him out in, in one attack. My impact on that miss. Never mind. We just got the win on that. So that's another chest for us to open. That's a pretty stone in that one. I just want to check. So we've got a long way to level up. Uh, so there's the red one. Cottage. So we're going to go for this one all the way over here. So we can get past the invisible walls that it adds in. Are we getting closer to it? No, it seems to have hit a dead end. There we go. Finally made it. Then we've got one more left before we move on. So we've just got standard markers in this one as well. Which makes me think that the reward for this isn't going to be as good as some of the others. It tends to be on kind of how hard the fight is, I think, to determine what your what your prize is, so to speak. Uh, AP up, that's not bad. 
I was expecting like a potion. So last one is here. There's no way he just dropped from that. That's so annoying. Oh, I need to heal. Right, Donald, I need some help, buddy. Right, so Donald didn't decide to help me there. There's that big attack. Donald just seems to only want to help Goofy at the moment. That's alright because... Oh, stop flying around, you annoying thing! There we go, right. So they're all done, we've got all the chests. Two gales out of that as well, because we just got one from the chest. From the one we just beat as well, so that's that's good. So there for for synthesizing. Heal. So here we go again, we've got this big guy. Again, we know what to do, we know how to beat him. So health-wise, he looks like he's got a bit more than the one we did just beat a second ago. And possibly more than the original one we fought as well. No, 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 I fell down. Donald's finally come up for help. Get your eyes off. Donald's decided to help me for once. I mean, if we knock his head down again, then we win. I mean, if anything, we really need to knock his head down. Like this, it? There it is. Quite a lot of goodies out of that as well. into the most dangerous place and we find him. I was looking to see if there was a save point at all. But there's not, so we're just gonna go through, hopefully grab onto that. Chest over here. Open that. Drill. And then we go again. Didn't grab onto that one for some reason. chest and that is going to be where we need to go I think we, we're just doing shorter parts for for this bit 
so that was, you know, so you can see if you want to go in and get those chests or not, or if you just want to kind of get through that bit as quick as possible. And then in the next part, we we move forward and we will go and get to the to the end of the world and most probably finish the game. I would have thought. Um, so yeah, stay tuned for that one. Thanks for watching, guys. Stay safe. Take care. Peace.